I have found something. I found my camera. YouTube it is somewhere after 7 o'clock in the morning, Sunday, November 27th. I am not having a good morning. I really hope that anyone who uh, will uh, who finds out that I am going to move again will just do me a huge favor and shoot me. This is the uh, the state of our kitchen right now. I uh, got up at about six to uh, and decided I was going to try and take a shower. And that uh, involved finding all of the bath stuff. And uh, once I had found all of the bath stuff, I then decided that I was going to make coffee. And I would take a shower while I was making coffee. Well, you see that the coffee pot is empty because I spent the next 45 minutes looking for my coffee filters, which we have discovered are in the trunk of Phil's car, which for reasons unknown he never unloaded. So at that point I decided that I would look for my camera and do a blog about it. And I've spent the next half hour trying to find my camera. Because Roman took it out of the case with the intentions of shooting a video last night and set it down on top of the box which I opened and dropped it back behind there you see. So my morning is not going well. Hopefully it's going to get better. I'm going to go out to uh, Enid and I'll show you guys where I keep all the toys now. And uh, we're going to get the four-wheeler into town so I got something better than the blazer to blast around with. And uh, might even go get the sand rail today and pull it in the garage so I got something to work on. Otherwise I'm going to drive Kayla absolutely nuts being in here rooting through stuff and she just wants to organize. Am I marginally correct, dear? Yes, but no camera. <laughs> you don't have your makeup on yet? I'll get the film crew in immediately. That's what I need. I need a film crew so they can come in and do my makeup. And put blush and rouge on. And then later on I'm going to Williston because Roman and I are going to Williston and Matt even actually might come with because um, why was it again? Oh we were going to get a desk but we figured out how to make this desk fit but uh, now we're just going up to get a stereo of some kind for the, uh, for the garage which I suppose I should show you but I will in a moment after I get a little bit more ready and decide to head out to Enid. So, we'll catch you in a minute. Okay, so I'm semi-arranged here. I still haven't gotten any coffee, but uh, I drank orange juice, thankfully before I brushed my teeth. I hate that taste. Um, actually got a computer set up, but no internet. We have to call uh, Mid Rivers and get uh, the internet uh, hooked up so I won't be able to put videos up but at least I'll be able to do some editing hopefully tonight if I'm not busy in the shop because I'm gonna head out to Enid like I said and uh, show you where the toys are kept so step outside I'll give you a quick tour of the garage and uh, look up to the trailer and go grab some coffee and get Jim's moving playing. poor little tarted kitty I love my little tarted kitty Jimmy has epilepsy. Jimmy is a tiny little kitten that we got from Charlie at some point in time. I don't know if I ever explained that in a video. I haven't been on YouTube in so long. But, uh, anyways, out the door we go. Bye bye. I haven't washed her face yet. <laughs> See when I get back from Eden, hon. Alright. Yep. Have a good trip. Yep, I will. Yep, I will. Yeah. Hey, Can you turn over that water dish on your way past? Yeah, yeah, I'll do that. Okay. Oh, so there's the garage. 
we just got to turn over this water dish because Morgan insists on tipping it over. There we go. Into the garage. I got to get him to you out here because I keep smelling gas. It's got a nice big furnace in it, 65,000 BTUs for this shop, which it's actually a fairly nice size. I don't know if it's gonna show real well in the videos or not, but basically if I pull the Jeep in, um, if I pull the Jeep in this door, we tried this yesterday, and leave the back end not quite butted up to the garage door, but close, it is, the front end of the Jeep is right about where I'm standing and gives you about that much room. So, I mean, it's fairly sizable. You can see, uh, uh, well, I broke my engine stand, or my engine, my cherry picker, lifting the motor and tranny. I knew I was lifting too much, and I was trying to lift it with this yellow strap. So it was all I had. This, this whole moving thing has just been an absolute pain in the ass, because everything's either packed up or not there, or we've left it behind. You can see I brought the KZ1300 along. I brought the engine donor for the golf cart along. That's all stuff that uh, all stuff that you guys have been missing out on. I, you know, to be perfectly honest, no, you really haven't missed out on much because since I quit making videos before, I uh, I really haven't done much. I got kicked out of the shop. I got told that I couldn't do my projects in the shop and. The only thing I could work on in there was uh, was ranch stuff. Otherwise, I was compromising ranch time and taking advantage of the ranch. So, I mean, I'm not going to get into that. But uh, so I was told that the only thing that I would do out at the ranch was work, and then I got busy at my full-time job, the one that was paying me or is paying me, and paying me very well. And then I was told that I wasn't dedicated because uh, I was working a full-time job. I'm jumping topic. I uh, really need to not do that. It's just a little emotional. But this is the other cool thing that comes with this house. International Harvester. The IH logo on there. And the best part is it works. Check it out, cold beer. The freezer works good. Yeah, I gotta super glue this part, but the freezer works awesome. I was just tickled pink. I thought maybe they left it here because uh, the previous owner left it here because it didn't work, and here it does. So, very cool. Um, the garage door on this side needs a little work. There's something wrong with those uh, little foot switches there. This one works fine though. However, we don't have um, we don't have any openers for it. And that's the other thing I got to look for in Williston today is openers. I got to remind myself of that. May have to go back in the house and make a list. But at any rate, um, I'm going to go ahead and get uh, hooked up to the little trailer with the blazer, and we'll get moving. <laughs> 